Hey, hey there, friends. It's your bad couch guru, Lynn Lamberg. And today, we're going to talk about your two-year mindset. Now, how many of you have ever been to a summer camp before? Or how many of you grew up in a church and went to a revival? It's revival weekend, and we're going to just have a really awesome time, and everything's going to change. Or, or how many of you have been to a corporate event or a team event where you come up with all this great strategy and all these plans and you're like, yeah, this is it, right? And then you come back home or you go back to work and everything's the same as normal. And then a couple weeks later, you forgot you ever went to that summer camp or that revival or that corporate retreat or that yoga retreat. It all just goes away, right? It's because we're humans and it takes a long time for habits and things to change. So here's something uh, that is very different about the couch to active and what we do. And it's we, we refer to it at the end of the couch to active book. My clients, my one on one clients, they really know this really well. And what it is, is it's called your two year plan. And we take everything we learn and we have a mindset that it's going to take two whole years for this to really settle in. And here's why. Year number one, the first year after you've learned all this couch active stuff and all these skills of how to keep this active lifestyle going, year number one, you need to constantly be refreshing on it. And I tell you how, because everything's new. It's your first couch to active birthday. It's your first couch to active Thanksgiving. It's your first couch to active 4th of July. Your first first time you're planning a vacation as a couch to active convert. Everything is new. Year number two is the very first year that you get to actually do again the things you did in year number one, or, or refresh or change. So you get to birthday number two and you're like, hey, I actually went for a walk on my birthday at this cool park and, and that was cool, but I think maybe I wanna do something else active for my birthday now. And you get really kind of get it dialed in. Year number one, people are like, who is this new freak who thinks she or he wants to exercise all the time? Year number two, people are like, huh, I wonder if they're going to keep doing that exercise. I wonder if they're still going to go for a walk after Thanksgiving. I wonder, blah, blah, blah. Year number three, you and everyone else in your life expects it to happen. That's the magic. That's when your couch to active lifestyle really gels. Because by year number three, you and the people in your life know, hey, you're not just going to do this for yourself for a year or two, this is who you are. And you and everybody else has kind of started to forget who you were before Couch to Active. So that's why the two-year mindset is super, super important. Alrighty, friends, get yourself thinking about that two-year mindset. If you don't yet have it, get the book. If you want to learn more, sign up for a free 30 minute call with me and I'll help get you dialed in and I'll get you going. All right, friends, have yourself a wonderful weekend and we'll see you on Monday. Bye bye now. Exercise should not be dreadful, but getting off the couch, we know, is the hardest exercise of all. Did you know that Couch to Active has an app? It's the easiest way to keep track of and follow the Couch to Active podcast. So head on over to your app store, and it doesn't matter whether you're on an iPhone, a tablet, or an Android device. Search for Couch to Active, that's T-O-Active, download the app, and check it out. Bye-bye now.